to design a DSP AC modulator to generate a modulator signal AC MOP cos omega CT the carrier frequency FC equal to 300 kilohertz omega C equal to 5 times 300,000 the following is available the stock room one is a, a sine wave generator of frequency 100 kilohertz the second is a ring modulator the third one is a band filter with adjustable standard frequency with a range of 100 kilohertz to 500 kilohertz so how you can generate the desired and we were just explain how to tune the band bus filter we were just the output of the modulator 400 cos omega c what should be the amplifier gain the input to obtain the desired modulator output signal okay let's so for the a part and b part yeah. so let's look at the analogy of okay. first we are gonna And then we are going to have a calculator. Here we have a ring calculator. We are going to band pass filter as well. Okay, and then this ring modulator is gonna have a diode or diode. Here we have a diode. Here we have a diode. Okay, so let's call this one B1. Let's call the diode B2. Let's call this one. Okay, uh, here we have A. This, this one is. Okay, so when we are passing the first wave to this, there's a positive half cycle and a negative half cycle. So when the positive half cycle happen, what's going to happen is this D2 and D4 is going to be open, and D1 and D3 is going to be conducting. So 
therefore the that time a c are connected and b are connected and when it's negative half cycle this uh, d1 and d3 is going to be open so a and d will be connected then b and c will be connected when it happens what's going to happen is we are going to have a square wave forming like we are going to be getting a square wave like Gonna form, and this one is omega naught of t, naught of t. The omega naught of t equation will be like this: four over five cos omega one over cos plus one over five plus five on and so on. So this plus one equation for one. And you want to this of time mega not of so here uh, mega not of this this expression multiplied by m of so what we are going to end up having we are going to have all the terms we did at have here is going to be multiplied by m of t so we will have an equation like this 4 over 5 m of t by cos omega 1 of 3 t cos 3 plus 4 over 5 Was five omega Let's close equation. <clears throat> so here what happens is we we use the ring model ring modulator the ring with cut off frequency if hold on hello this signal generator The output out pass will gender that. Let's see, equal to 300 kilohertz. Okay, they have given the range here. We can send for any of the phone. So they have given a bandpass filter with adjustable center frequency with a tuning range that kilohertz to 500 kilohertz. But here we are choosing 300 kilohertz because one will be better canceling. <coughs> Okay, so if we pass the equation 
we pass the equation to there is this Uh, to ban pass filter with the cut off frequency. That is this one three hundred three hundred kilohertz. Then omega c is going to be two phi f. So two phi times this three three hundred kilohertz. That is three hundred thousand hertz. So we are going to thousand right. That many radians per second. We are going to, okay. So when we do that, it's gonna suppress all the term except one term. Okay, let's see what it is. So then suppresses all the term. Except the one centered at three hundred thousand. Except the one that sent that thousand but corresponding to the carrier. Omega the filter output is okay. the carrier that is three omega does it correspond to this one is right over here okay one or three m of t first omega three omega c the others are going to eliminate so this four five multiplied by this is the equation derived so y of t is going to be equal to minus four over three phi m of t first omega three so first omega first three omega c Okay, the C part, what is asked? If the output of the modulator must be 400 M of T cos omega, that should be the amplifier gain to be used on the input of to obtain the desired modulator output. Okay, the output of the modulator 400 T cos omega 3 or omega C. What should be the amplifier gain to be used to obtain the modulator output signal? Okay, so for omega c, comma, the equation. Phi of t equals 
four over five here post yeah. also my test. Let's go to to get the output y of t to get the output y of that is equal to four hundred. Plus uh, we just try to equate four and five. So if we equate four and five, all the terms cancels. We end up with this one: four over five is equal to four over five a and equal to four hundred. Therefore, if you solve for a, you will end up with hundred five. So this is the amplifier gain to the at the input demo. Okay, this is the amplifier gain we have to use. And that's it for this video. I have to um I hope you guys found this video helpful. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe my channel. See you guys on my next video.